Well, it's twofold. So yes, it is also just to comply with to check off that box. Right. So that, so do what 70 says, right? That's pretty straightforward. However, Which OSHA interprets the 70E as their standard. Right. It's a recognized standard for electrical safety. Yes, absolutely. So yeah, it could be checking a box and that, you know, that's somewhere to start. If that's the only reason it's better than nothing. But the real reason that you would want to do these, the reason it's even in the 70E is because things change over time. And so if you had a good electrical safety program, you know, on X year and then five, six years later, you have new equipment or new employees or new processes, which is, which is likely. Yes. Very likely. <laughs> and you haven't gone back and just made sure that everything in your program still applies to those new procedures or pieces of equipment or PPE that you purchase, um, then it's kind of useless and it could result in there being a knowledge gap between management and workers, which, you know, could lead to even bigger issues of, well, you know, management and safety 